I am Anil Kumar and here is a practice question to find domain. The question here is find domain of the function f of x equals to square root of 1 minus 5 to the power of x. You can pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. Now as you know within square root we should have non-negative number right. So therefore to find the domain we should solve the inequality 1 minus 5 to the power of x whatever is there within the square root that has to be greater than equal to 0 non-negative that is important so let me make a note here that this portion whatever is there within square root should be non-negative and that should give you the solution right so uh, now we can actually uh, take one so solving this is I'll do it in more steps than required by taking one to this side so we have minus 5 to the power of x is greater than or equal to minus 1 when you multiply by a negative number the inequality also changes so if you multiply by negative number you get 5 to the power of x less than or equal to 1 correct now to solve such an exponential function what should you do you can take log both sides right? that's the best way to solve you can take log to the base 10 or ln natural log to the base e we normally prefer to work with ln in such cases so let's take log which is ln 5 to the power of x on both the sides so you get ln 1 now log of 1 is 0 right so it is 0 and that gives you x ln 5 solving this we can get 0 divided by ln 5 is 0 so x should be less than or equal to 0 divided by ln 5 which is 0 so x should be less than or equal to 0 so that is the solution so in this case x should be less than 0 and therefore we can write that the domain of f of x is x belongs to real numbers where x is less than or equal to 0 right you can also get to this result if you look into the graph of 5 to the power of x uh, let me sketch this graph here and then we'll understand how the graph of 5 to the power of x is something like this so I'm not sketching exact graph but that will give you an idea so so in this graph what you notice is that at x equals to 0 5 to the power of x will be 1 correct so for values less than x equals to 0 5 to the power of x will be less than 1 values beyond 0 on the right side is going to be greater than 1 correct and so therefore from this graph also where I'm plotting 5 to the power of x you can make out that the value of x should be less than or equal to 0 right at 0 it is 1 so that is permitted 1 minus 1 is 0 so you could get result from the graph also that's a good alternative right so let me write down alternate method right so you could do by understanding of your uh, exponential functions I hope that helps thank you and all the best